Okay, so today we're going to talk about the Blastatron Mini. Is it good? Whew. Oh yeah! <laughs> this gun is my favorite pistol in the history of Save the World. If you guys love what we're doing here, um, please use our supporter creator code. It helps us out so, so much. It really helps us keep doing what we're doing here. Thank you so much, guys. I like this gun more than I like the Whisper 45. This is the longest range pistol. I don't think there's any pistol that has more than 4,000 range. This gun is insane. This is basically an assault rifle in pistol form. <laughs> man, oh man, this gun is just absolute insane. It's just insanity. It's crazy. It's so it doesn't even make sense. This gun is so mental. So let's talk about why this gun is so just out of this world. <laughs> it's very appropriate for the sci-fi pistol. The reason this gun is so crazy is because this is a fully automatic pistol. Fast firing, automatic Good for run and gun situations, meaning yes, you can move around and not be affected by bloom. This thing, imagine this gun is the hemlock. It doesn't have the greatest bloom, but the bloom never changes. It never gets bigger. There is no bloom whatsoever. You have your starting reticle starts out, you know, a little bigger than normal guns, but it it's mechanical. It never, ever deviates from that. So you're, you, you have a little bit of spray, you know, a little bit of, you know, inaccuracy, but it never goes worse than that ever. So whether you're shooting at long range or short range or whatever, you know, if you're at long range, you really have to aim center mass so that, you know, that little bit of bloom doesn't cause you to miss. But if you're at close range, you just put the gun in their mouth and blow their face off. Uh, this thing hits like a truck, man. So yeah, this that that's that's really the key. This thing is is uh, it is a four thousand range weapon, just like the Hemlock. It has the same minimum bloom as the Hemlock. It has the same um, bloom resistance as the Hemlock. Whether you're moving or not doesn't matter. Um, obviously, it's a little tighter if you stop moving and you aim down the sights. But even when you're moving, aiming down the sights is still rock solid no problem at all just a solid consistent beast weapon and now let's talk about the damage because this thing is fully automatic but this thing just absolutely obliterated everything i'm running this with a crit rate crit damage crit damage reload build of course energy each shot fired grants 1.8 critical rating for one second stacks up to 15 times so it's got a ramping crit rate passive so the more you shoot the better your crit chance is just unreal like it's really good even if you're not getting it stacked up to 15 it doesn't matter it's a solid bonus to your offensive you know damage you're going to get more crits because of that whether it's fully stacked or not you know the more you stack it the better it is but i wouldn't even worry about it because this gun is out of control man out of control the damage does not make sense this gun hits so hard and is so accurate and reloads so fast let's take a look at the stats here and just completely rock your socks off so this thing hits so hard man seven on me it's seventeen thousand. It's kind of hard to 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 give you a comparison because my stats are my stats, right? I'm I'm running a maxed out build, so at the top tier of of gameplay, this is what the gun's gonna look like, more or less. Seventeen thousand damage, twenty one thousand headshot. It's got a fifteen percent base crit, meaning a forty three percent critical hit chance. Uh, Five hundred and seventy percent crit damage. <laughs> so good 6.3 fire rate so really slow actually a really slow fire rate compared to other um all the other fully automatic pistols um all the machine pistols fire between 10 and 
18 fire rate, where this one's rock, rocking like 6.3. So it fires much slower, but not slow by any means. 6.3 is perfect. It feels so good. Just bam, 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 bam. Like just rocking shots into the enemies. 20 mag size is no problem at all, especially considering the reload time is 1.4. Just mental fast. Just like, oh, what? Click, click, click. Ready to go. Click, click, click. Oh, good to go. It's just like, oh, click, done. Click, done. Like this thing is like, just never ends. It just never ends. This thing is a monster weapon. This is the most powerful pistol I've ever used in the history of this game. And the fact that ba that that the energy ammo is going to be craftable without using bacon soon. Oh my god. I wasn't even using pistol characters since the hero rework because I disliked everything so much. The pistols didn't feel good enough. You know, the, the loadout was okay. But, man oh man. With the new, uh, the new loadouts, the new characters. Uh, this gun is just... It hits heights formerly just never before seen like this thing is something truly special man i hope you guys don't miss out on the sci-fi set because there are some gems gems hidden inside of here uh, i really didn't have a lot of faith honestly when i saw energy weapons i'm like it's gonna be vendor tech all over again but i guarantee you it is not this is one of the most powerful guns ever made and this gun this alone makes me want to play pistol characters again because dang man ranger beetle jess is back in town <laughs> all right guys i want to thank my um my twitch community for hooking me up with this gun um obviously i was not able to god roll all of these guns or even collect them all um i'm i'm still finishing off you know campaign stuff and, and uh building my war games uh, and all kinds of things. So I wasn't able to focus on, uh, you know, God rolling. I don't even have the resources to God roll right now because the military set completely cleaned me out. So I got to really give a, a big thanks out to my Twitch community for coming through and God rolling some of these weapons to exactly my specifications and giving me the opportunity to review these things for you guys and see if they're good or bad and whatnot. So, you know, thank you so much. Thank you to the Vash Core. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for having my back on Twitch and on YouTube. Uh, I couldn't be doing this without you guys. We are streaming over on Twitch over 18 hours a day, seven days a week, no days off, doing 81-hour marathons every single weekend. I'd love to see you guys come and be a part of my community. Come and join us. Come and uh, watch the show, play some games, keep me company, and have some fun. Rock and roll, guys. Make sure you like and subscribe. Ring that little bell. Comment down below and let me know what you think of the uh, this new gun and all of the guns. Yeah, what, how are you feeling about the sci-fi stuff? Because man, oh man, there is some gems hidden in this set. Rock and roll, guys. All right, Vash out. <laughs> See you in the next video.